just got back from uh, California, from San Jose, and dropped in on uh, NorCal. And Jason Khalifa had a great uh, suggestion and comment and uh, critique. He said, why don't we have any CrossFit-specific workouts programmed into the monitor? We have a number of sort of rowing-specific longer things, but it seems to make sense. Uh, and in fact, you can do that yourself with the custom list function. And I'm going to show you how to do that right now. This is the main menu of the monitor. And if I go to select a workout, you'll see there's a standard list and a custom list. Now these are the lists of pre-programmed workouts. Let's talk about that. Okay, programmed workouts on the monitor. The programmed workouts are really meant to make things easier and quicker for you. And there's two types of lists of workouts. One is the standard list, one is the custom list. Now these two stay in the monitor all the time. The third type is called favorites. And the favorites actually reside on either the log card or a USB, log card with the PM three or four, a USB stick on the PM5. So the standard list is made up of five workouts that are longer in length and more um, conditioning related. The custom list is, the big thing is here, you can edit this list to make this whatever you'd want. And the way you do that is first create the workout on your favorites on a log card or USB, and then transfer it into the custom list with the log card utilities. Once you transfer that, it will always be on that monitor. So if you have five, ten machines in your box, you can create a custom list of a custom list that stays on all those machines all the time. And you do that by first, with log card or USB stick, create the workouts you want on your machines in your favorite list, and then transfer them all into the custom list, and then they'll always be there for you. This is the log card that you would use uh, for a PM3 or 4, and a standard USB stick functions the same way as the log card on the PM5. So I have a PM5 here, so I will use the USB stick. I'm putting it in the back. Turn this monitor on. Now once it recognizes that the USB stick is there, main menu, First thing I do is select a workout. Now you notice that there's standard list, custom list, and favorites because I have the stick in. But what I want to do is to set up a new workout and put it onto my favorite. And I'll do a Tabata workout, which is a interval, specific length of time, and specific number of intervals. Time will be 20 seconds of work. and 10 seconds of rest. That's the first interval. Second interval is the same. Third, fourth, fifth, an eighth interval. Same work time, but I'm going to set zero rest on that because it's the last one. Okay, and there is no ninth interval. And I do want to save it to my favorite list. And I'll replace this one, which isn't there. So now I'm set to row that as a favorite, but I don't want to row it just now. So if I go back to the main menu, I will see, if I select a workout now on my favorite list, there is my Tabata. 
because I just put it onto that favorite list. You'll see also on my favorite list, I have some other workouts that um, are short, 30 seconds, maybe go max calories for 30 seconds, one minute, 500, and a short ver interval workout. The next thing we're going to do is transfer those workouts on the favorite list into the custom list. That's a logbook utility. I hit the button for logbook. Logbook utility, edit custom list. Okay. And what I want to do is to copy all of those workouts onto the custom list. I could just copy one if I just had one to change, but I'm copying all of them. So now if I go back to main menu, I should find on the custom list, there's my CrossFit specific workouts. So now if I take my USB stick or log card to another machine and insert it, I can transfer those favorites from the log card onto the custom list and they'll always stay with that PM, with that machine. So now my USB stick is no longer in. I select the workout. You'll see the favorite doesn't show up because the stick's not in. But on the custom list, there's my Tabata and I'm ready to go. Okay, so hopefully with using the log card for PM3 or 4 or a USB stick on the PM5, we've answered Jason's question of how do we get CrossFit specific workouts programmed into the monitors. So now you can take your stick or your card, go to all your machines in the box, upload everything to the custom list and they'll always be on that custom list for you.